Meanwhile, Beijing has confirmed that it will go ahead with new air routes in the middle of the Taiwan Strait, a move that Taiwan worries will threaten aviation safety and its sovereignty. The Transportation Ministry responded Thursday by taking a hard line, talking about using military planes to maintain order, but a military expert saw that as simply talk. China announced that its four controversial new routes near the Taiwan Strait median line will take effect on March 5th, despite Taiwan's objections. The head of the Mainland Affairs Council was vague yesterday when saying how Taiwan would react. But on Thursday, Deputy Transportation Minister Zheng Garzhen took a hard line, announcing that if Chinese passenger planes crossed the line, Taiwan's Air Force fighters would be sent to warn away or intercept the planes. If you want military planes to observe every passenger plane, our military will use up its annual reserves of jet fuel in just two months. So I think this is transportation ministry experts saying amateurish things. The Civil Aeronautics Administration has said that Taiwan and China would work on reaching an aviation safety consensus before the new routes were launched. But China has ignored Taiwan's appeals, and figuring out how to deal with the issue will test the Mainzhou government.